as I put back on my rings, um, this is my what I got and what I gave for Christmas video. I've tried to film this multiple times, but I just finally got the motivation today to look presentable on camera. Um, last ring. Now I feel not any good. The first half of the video, I'm going to show what I got for Christmas. Um, I'm going to be showing gifts that I got from my um, parents, so my mom and my dad, and then a couple of my friends, and my friends from college did a secret Santa. So I'm going to show the gifts from that, and then I'm either going to show pictures or the stuff that I got for my friends um, and family. Why was that so hard for me to say? Anyways, um, my disclaimer is that I'm not trying to brag. I feel like we know. You know, if you're watching, you know. And I am so unbelievably grateful for everything that I received this year. I was truly, truly, truly blessed with everything that I got as every year, any gift that I get, I feel like super blessed to get it. So yeah, that is my disclaimer. Um, and now on into the video. So the first thing I actually already used today, um, it's this Revlon One Step Hair Dryer. Um, yeah, I really love this. I've only used it once and I'm not very good at it yet. I really don't know what I'm doing with it, but I'm sure over time I will get better at like blowing it out and for the first use and for my first try, it was really good. I really wanted this specifically, like one has the brush and the hair dryer in one because I just couldn't imagine myself using a round brush in a hair dryer. I feel like I would get too overwhelmed. I like things to be easy for me. This realization, <laughs> um, long sleeve with the cowboy, um, I'm so in love with this. I, this is my first thing I've ever owned from Realization. It's never gonna leave my closet. I'm so obsessed with it. I love the colors of this little cowboy person. And yeah, I'm just very excited to wear it out. I feel like I'm gonna wear this a lot just because I've been into a t-shirt and jeans and I don't really have any long sleeve t-shirts that are like fitted, so she'll be she'll be well used as will everything because i'm obsessed with everything and then the realization um shirt came with this bag so cute definitely going to be using this for when i go thrifting and just in life because it's so pretty like it's simple but effective <laughs> the next thing is in here um I am so happy that I got this. This gold, it's what's it called? It's called the Cupid necklace and it's in gold. So cute. If it's not focusing well, I'll put a picture. But I'm so happy about this and it's so nice. Like the charm is like really weighty. And I love the chain. And it's the perfect length. The 18 inch is like the perfect length for me. So whenever I see that necklaces are 18 inches, I'm like, yes, this is funny. So <laughs> my parents, so my parents got me a hydro flask. Why is it funny? You ask, first of all, this color, what color is this? Wood stove. I love it. It's like a brown gray color. I love it. And it has the orange detailing. <laughs> But this is funny because I had got, I had just bought my own water bottle. Um, this one from TJ Maxx, like a couple weeks ago, like three weeks ago. And my mom told me like when I showed, I already, can you see? I love stickers. Anyways, my mom told me like when I showed her that I got it, she was like so sad because she had already got me this, but I'm still going to use it because I feel like with reusable water bottles since like i'm using it constantly i forget like sometimes you just need to wash it and let it breathe like i think that's just i don't know if that's like a requirement but i just feel like that would be better 
Um, so this will encourage me to give water bottles a break. Um, and I love that color. The next thing that I got from my parents is this. <laughs> I love this so much. I just couldn't. I could die. It's this Lolita Jade. Um, it's a messenger bag style. And it's the Pony Girl fabric, I believe. I think that's what it's called. But I have been wanting a fur bag for like a year. And I just haven't... I just haven't like bit the bullet on it, but I saw this because um, Lolita J has been like popping off this year. I saw this and I was like, okay, I absolutely need this. I'm gonna ask for it for Christmas. Um, and I got, I really like the messenger style. So it's really, really well made. I haven't used it yet, but so I can't tell you like how much fits in here, but I feel like I could like fit my journal, like the regular things that I keep. I could, I feel like I keep all that in here. And now I can be one of those girls. I can be one of those girls that have the fur bag. Oh my God, I'm so happy about this. And I just, the last things I got from my parents are from Heaven by Marc Jacobs. And I love, love this brand so much. And I've been eyeing pieces from them for a couple months now. I'm very, 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 very happy about this. And I can't wait to style it. And then look at that tag. Hold on. Look at that tag. So good. It's never leaving my wardrobe. This getting this is now a family heirloom. But I got this Heaven by Marc Jacobs shopper tote. I'm very excited to use this for when I go sourcing. And just like in life in general. Like I'm very excited about this bag. It's huge but yeah very excited and very grateful for this next thing that i got i'm gonna do let's do daniel first so for from daniel i got this little that little pop socket here but let's bring you closer um he got me this um uh pop socket I'll put a closer, better picture of it, but it basically says my username on it, and I don't really put things on my phone cases because they're wildflower, and I am very protective of my wildflower cases, and he was like, oh, I, I've been using mine. <coughs> Sorry. I've been using mine to hang up my mask, so maybe you could use it for that, and I was like, that is absolutely genius because I'm always losing my mask, and then... Daniel is my friend who I have my podcast with, Our Hollywood. If you don't know what that is, he and I, well, we just wrapped season one and we talk about anything that has to do with Hollywood, movies, television, um, some episodes that we've done. We've done How Fashion Can Make a Break Film. We've done The Evolution of Disney Princesses, um, Black Horror. We've done feminist, um, Feminism of Final Girls, a bunch of different things. So there's 15 episodes, I believe, that are out now. So I'll also link that and go listen to our podcast. And we're going to start season two in mid-January. So I'm very excited. But he got these mugs made for us because we always drink water while we're doing the podcast just because we talk a lot. So you need to drink water. Um, you need to drink water in general. But And we also drink coffee too while we're doing the podcast. So he got these made for us, which is, this is like our logo. So I'm very, this is so freaking cute. I love this. Um, and we used it in our last podcast. And also we have a YouTube channel. So if you prefer to like watch, you can also do that. And I'll also link that. And the last thing that Daniel got me is this Midsummer Summer <laughs> tote bag. Here's like it closer up. It says, from director who brought you hereditary comes a new twisted tale of terror. The brightest light casts the darkest shadow coming summer 2019. And we both love Midsummer. It's so funny because we basically got each other like the same things. Uh, you'll get it. You'll get it when I get there. Um, and then from my friend, from my friend Vita, but she got me these two necklaces. We both love personalized jewelry which is funny because i also got her 
like the same things like all my friends and i were like on the same <laughs> like wavelength this year when we got each other gifts so she got me one that says k one that says l i have rings that say kl because those are my initials and and also i got this ring today it says l on it but i thought that was so sweet and i love pearls i love a good gold i don't have any chains like this and i love it I like little paper 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 clip chain i feel like this is what that's called but they're so freaking cute the last thing that vita got me was this um harry styles candle and it says patron saint of masculinity and it's from the vogue photo shoot so i love that the last is it yeah the last things i'm going to show that i got for christmas are from my um friends so my college friends since there's like how many of them are one two three four five six six seven including me so there's yeah there's seven of us there's seven of us um that participated in secret santa this year and i got or my friend darby got me for secret santa and this is what she got me she got me first thing is this um blockbuster party game it's kind of like charades for movies and i'm gonna force daniel to play with me so play this with me so daniel if you're watching this you have to play with me because i don't think my parents would be good at this i'll have to look at the cards maybe i can play with my parents the next thing that my friend darby got me were these earrings they're so cute and funky and basically they're just like these super funky like retro earrings and she got me orange because she was like i feel like you don't have many orange earrings because that's just like a little bit of earrings i have like a whole why am I standing so close? I have such a, I have a whole setup over there just for earrings and like necklaces and stuff. So she was like, I don't think you have many orange things. So that's why you're orange. So very thoughtful, very, very thoughtful. And the last thing I think, again, I'm so sorry, Darby, if you got me on nails. Oh, you did. It's right here. I'll put a picture of it up here. But she got me this poster. It says treat people with kindness. And I really like this because with this friend group, I don't think Darby was there. I don't think she was there. But with some other people from the friend group, we went to the Fine Line pop-up in LA. And that they have that. I don't know if they have it any other Fine Line pop-up that they did. I don't think they did. But this sign is like still up in hollywood so i think it's a cute little reminder of like a memory that i have with those friends so that's fun and then the last thing she got me is this recipe tin because i love cooking and i would i would like to have again like i'm thinking about thinking ahead like what am i gonna leave behind what am i gonna have for my future family and I thought a recipe box would be really cute because I feel like I cook well. But I really like this one because I like the interior. This blue color is everything. I love blue. I like this light blue color. And it comes with like little dividers. So I can alphabetize them. So that's cute. And then also she got me some little cards that I can write my recipes down on. They're so freaking cute. So that is all that I got for Christmas. I'm, I literally am so grateful. I just love exchanging gifts with people and like seeing people like get happy. I like the things. Yeah. I love giving the gifts, which brings me to, this is what I gave for Christmas. So since I already gave out a lot of them, I'm just gonna kind of like talk through them. So I'll start with my parents. So the first thing I got, got them what did i get oh i got my dad a um long sleeve with his favorite um nfl team then i got my mom some new shirts um let me go get them hold on i've returned so for my mom first got her this perfume this ysl perfume I like ran up and down the stairs. Anyways, and then I also got my mom this 
shirt. I just wanted to give her some like updated the way I'm wearing also this type of sleeve. Anyways, I've been trying to get my mom some more clothes to like update her closet because I'm forcing her into a closet clean out. <laughs> she has too many things in there that are like, I'm like, we need to donate, get rid of, cycle, cycle them through the process, you know what I mean? So I got her this top. I'm trying to force her into these like billowy sleeves type of action, like kind of like this kind of sleeve. And I feel like it's a good update for her closet. <sighs> Breathe. <laughs> and then I got her this top, also from Target, because I feel like she doesn't wear a lot of colors. So I wanted to give her something a little bit more out of her comfort zone. The way I just kind of gave my mom like a style bundle. <laughs> so I got her this. It's like mustardy yellow and like brown. So I think it's not too bright still within the comfort zone and again with the billowy sleeve i got that from my mom and my both my parents got these cups because they both like drinking coffee before they go to work and for my dad got him that shirt and i got him and the cups and then this ring um security system i just got this for the front door um and it's a ring you know it's a video doorbell so that is what I got from my dad so for Daniel I got him this scream face mask because his one of his favorite movies ever is scream and he wears a lot of like disposal masks so I wanted to get him like a reusable one because we're gonna probably have to wear a mask for a minute and I thought this one was really cute for him so I got him that and then he has this picture on his Instagram um nothing it was from midsummer what are they called the maypole not <laughs> anyways that thing's called the maypole so i found a etsy shop that she designed like she drew it so i got him a sticker for that and he put it in like his phone case so that's cute and what was the last thing i got him oh i got him this mug which is this mug <laughs> from knives out and that's another one of his favorite movies and if you haven't watched Knives Out, you really need to. It's literally, it's so good. So yeah, I got that for Daniel. For my friend Vita, I got her this dress. I'll have to ask her to send me a picture of it because I don't think I took a picture of it beforehand. But I got her this dress. Doesn't she look so good in it? She looks so bomb. Like when she tried it on, I was like, yep. But I saw it, I found it and I was like, she absolutely needs this in her life. So I got that for her for Christmas and then I got her I got her a necklace or two necklaces. These ones from Fraser Jewelry. Well I got this one and then the choker came for free. So I got her, I don't know what it's called, but it's like a ID tag necklace with the rhinestones and the rhinestone is the V because her name's Vita. And then this choker me, this choker came with it. Then for my secret Santa, this is what I got. So I got my friend Claudia. For our secret Santa, we need like a little PowerPoint where we put like a mood board and like ideas. And I got pretty much everything off of her idea list just because I wanted to make sure that she got the stuff that she really wanted. And then I, I added a couple extra things. First thing I got her is this poetry book, which she asked for it. And I was swiping through it and it's so cute. I love it. Um, and then I got her, oh, I got her this mascara, this Maybelline mascara, because she also likes that. And I put, like, some Ferrero Rocher's and some, like, chocolate kisses because she loves sweets and she loves Ferrero Rocher. So I had to make sure I had to throw some of those in there for her. Oh, I got her these earrings from Earrings on the Block. I love that shop. Um, I'll also link her shop down below i wanted to get her some like cute little like subtle but bougie earrings so i got her these they like reminded me of her and then i got her oh also in the same vein of she likes to get bougie and dressed up like so cute um i got her the this like little set of mac lip glosses and they're all in like nude shades so i knew they would like be a good bet for her to wear them and they came in like this little purse and it's super cute it reminds me of, like new year's eve which is so sad that we can't like really 
go out and party and do things like that but you know she'll be able to take some cute ass selfies with <laughs> those lipsticks on and the last thing that i got her is this pop socket because she loves drake and i had to make sure that i included something that had drake in it and he looks so good in this picture i was like okay this has to be it before the end i forgot my grandparents gifts so for my grandma i got her this frame it says best song grandma, grandma ever and then i made a little collage of all her grandchildren I'm not gonna put that picture up there though because my cousins are children so i'm not gonna show their faces for their privacy and for my grandpa i don't know if i'm ever if i'm going to find the actual sweater but he wore he wears like a lot of maroon that's like what i remember him by so i got him a maroon sweater that is this or looks like this and that is everything that i got and gave for christmas i hope you all had a happy holidays even if you don't celebrate christmas i hope you had a good time this holiday season as good as it could be in quarantine and i just wish you all the best and i hope you all have a happy new year and stay safe wear your mask and just yeah i don't know how to end youtube videos can you tell <laughs> thank you guys for watching and i will see you in the next one bye